99.7 DJX, the Ben Davis and Kelly K Show podcast. Turn it up. On demand. Sugar. Ben and Kelly, 99.7 DJX. Now that we're into November, apparently this is peak lusty deer season. Oh, wow. And these horny deer are out, and that means that you have a greater risk of hitting one of them. Oh, no. Yeah. Well, that's not good. That's not good for the deer. That's not good for your car. No, not at all. And the Kansas City Police Department actually put it bluntly in a tweet saying, lusty deer are abounding oh, wow. <laughs> on area roadways right now. And so they actually have tips because we can, in this area, appreciate a lot of those lusty deer in our uh, area. So be careful. But the tips that they have for these Amorous, lusty deer are kind of funny as well from the Kansas City Police Department. If a deer runs in front of you, don't swerve to avoid it. That often causes a more serious crash. Okay, so what are they suggesting here? It's hard, but just hit the deer and don't make a bad situation. Hit the deer! Just hit it? They're just, saying just, just hit it. <laughs> just just keep going. Over. And do some deer bowling. What the heck? Listen, you lusty deer, get out of my way. Listen, it was your fault for being in the road. You should take a cold shower, you... (laughs) (laughs) Go as far off the road as possible and call 911. Yeah. Stay inside your vehicle until we get on scene. Okay. It's a lot safer and it won't make an additional traffic hazard. Okay, so what if you do hit that deer? Don't worry about the animal. We'll take care of it. We'll take care Don't of it. Don't worry about the animal, but then what's like, what if you kill Bambi? What? We'll take care of it. <laughs> I, oh, oh, wow. I don't know. I don't Go know ahead if it's the best advice. I mean, I, I guess it's Run over is. those lusty deer. I mean, you don't want to swerve and cause a worse accident that could damage, you know, lots of other things in your life and hurt you and hurt others. But still, oh, this is just, oh, it's dangerous. I mean, that's what they're saying. They're saying, listen, you don't want to. Uh, risk injuring yourself or others by swerving out of the way for those Getting horny in the way deer. Of another car, yeah. yeah, but uh, you know, shouldn't be really taken lightly. Just can you hit- slam on your brakes as much as possible to, you know, lessen the strike? Kelly just hit the deer. Okay. You heard All the right. man. You heard the police officer. If a deer runs don't, you, don't swerve to avoid it. That often causes a more serious crash. It's hard, but just hit the deer and don't make a bad situation. <laughs> Okay. All right. I love okay. the I love the cheery music that they have. They're like, "Hey, it's all right. Just hit the deer. It's fine. It'll be fine." There are other deer. I, I just I don't know. I okay. So listen, I feel like maybe on these roads where you see the signs of the leaping deer, right? That maybe we give traffic a little extra room in case they do need to slam on their brakes, right? All I know as is that the deer are so blinded by lust yeah. that they're not even worried about you and your car zooming they're down the highway. Running across the road with reckless abandon. Yeah, they're trying to mate as quickly as possible. So just know, and let okay. this be a warning to all yeah. of you who are within the sound of our voice right now. Yeah, I live in Shelby County. I mean, this is my real life. Like, we have a lot of deer out here. Oh, so Kelly, 100%, you need to watch out for those horny deer. Yeah, exactly. You They're are... running around muck in our neighborhood, let alone all the roads, the county roads back here. Yeah, no, it, this is real. And if you come across one, mm-hmm. do as the police say and hit it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, wow. It's a-